Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang. I'm a math expert from St. Petersburg, Florida, and we're here to talk about how to get a math tutoring job. Now, the three things that you'll need here would be an education, experience, and of course, the payoff, a job. So we're here to talk about just a couple of basic strategies and the path to help you find that math tutoring job. The first I recommend is to get the highest degree possible. Now, that means the more math courses that you take, but also the higher the math degree that you can get. Now, a bachelor's in math would be great. A graduate degree, uh, like a master's, would be even better, especially if it's that in math. Or if you get a PhD, that's even better. But you would probably get a job teaching it as opposed to tutoring it. Now, in tr the more math courses that you take, of course, that, ma that makes you the more versatile in the math field and the more courses that you can tutor in and perhaps the more money. Now, the more appealing you are to potential employers out there. So definitely get the highest degree possible. Now, after you get that degree, you want to get as much experience as possible, whether it be paid or non-paid. Now, to kind of get yourself an idea as to what kind of a tutor you can be, tutor as many students as possible, and what that'll do is it'll help you discover what your strengths are as well as the areas that you need to work on in preparation for that math tutoring job. And the more places that you volunteer in or tutor in, the more students that you have, the more references that you can get, and that'll help you on your resume when it comes to getting that math tutoring job. Which brings us to the third piece of this puzzle, getting the job itself. On the application, you can definitely list the degree that you have, the higher the better, as well as the various places and students that you've worked in, and that'll increase your success in getting that position. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and that is how you can get a math tutoring job.